Colin Kaepernick, of like, course, no. still out of a job. Not for long if Kanye West has anything to say about it. Ye promised to call his buddy in the White House to set up a meeting with Cap to make things right. I don't know how I feel about this. There's a lot to unpack here. Um, you think Ye is going to somehow figure out Colin Kaepernick in the NFL? Hell no. He can't even figure out himself. Like, the people are not behind Kanye. Like, no. Kanye thinks he's still the Kanye from, like, 2008 or something. And, like... He's, Marcellus even had to put a quantifier on. He's like, I'm wearing Yeezys, but they're pre cray Yeah, what did you say? They're pre, this, pre cray -yay. These, these pre cray -yay. These are yeah. like season three. He's, so, yeah, he's, he's, he's on season eight. But right will, will he help win the people back if he can get Cap back on the football field? No, not, no he's the... And, it, and to the, the culture, White House have the power... To the to culture, he's a weirdo. So it's the weirdo being like, hey, uh, okay, President Trump. All right, what Cap is trying to say is, and we like, dude... Don't even say anything else. We got other people to talk about that issue. Well, I think the call actually already happened. And here well, at here's my... Football, because we have reporters like Best Friend Desi and Liz Loza, we were able to get our hands on the call. So take a listen. Oh, no. <laughs> Yo, what's up? This is Cap. Leave a message after the beep. What up, Cap? It's Ye again. My fourth message got cut off, and that's not really sitting right in my spirit. But I want to abolish what I said in my last message anyway. I want to help you amend and justices you've been bringing attention to and abolish people's mindset about things. We have to amend the hate, bro. Like, let's speak on it. Don't speak on my wife, but let's speak on what you want to speak on, just not my wife. It don't, it's just not sitting right with my energy, that whole conversation about my wife. But everything you're doing, bro, I'm, 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 I'm on it, yo. Like, if you want to come meet with me and Trump, which I can do because I'm Kanye, I think we could even get them to add an abolishment to the Constitution. Oh, hold on, it's, it's a train going by. All right, well, that's it, man. Just hit me back, all right? It's Jesus. <laughs> that was really good, dude. That was yeah. really good. All right, time again. Time <laughs> well, out I, again. I for, don't, uh, I don't know. But you don't I, like it? You didn't I, like James' no, performance? No, I like, I like James' performance. No, I love what James did. <laughs> but my whole issue is the whole Kanye thing, right? Because when you represent a culture or people, people look to you, there's youth. And when you have a voice, a powerful voice, and you spew hateful things or things that's get, that you don't have a true perspective on, right? You just, I feel like he just regurgitates information that he takes from people, and he doesn't word it the right way. So he's just trying to make an impact and say things, but really he's just trying to sell a product by saying these things, right? He doesn't know where he wants to go, right? And he needs someone to get in the car with him to make him feel like he's accepted by the black community because he knows that he doesn't have that. And who does have the black community behind him? Colin Kaepernick. So why do you want to try to dra dra um, drag down someone else into the sunken place with you? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? To do what you're doing when, because you want somebody to, to um, legitimize you, right? Take that dumb ass shit that you be saying all the time, ball it up, throw it in the trash can with the rest of the trash you've been doing lately and burn that shit just like the same way they started burning those Nikes recently. That's what you could do, Kanye. Fuck you.